The first term you should learn is revolutions per minute. To do revolutions per minute, you just count the number of revolutions in one minute, or you count the revolutions in a certain amount of time and scale up to one minute. So for instance, I would pause my simulation when my object gets to an easy spot to recognize. Okay, so I stopped it just about on the x-axis. At this point, I will start my timer and resume my simulation. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it ran about seven times in 11.43 seconds. So to find your number of revolutions in a minute, all you need to do is scale these values up to 60 seconds. So you can set up a, a proportion, seven revolutions in 11.43 seconds is the same as X revolutions in 60 seconds. Solving for X is the quickest way of getting your RPMs.